Feminism isn't about making women stronger. Women are already strong. It's about changing the way the world perceives that strength. So, how do we expect our world to change when our society is mainly governed by men? They are still the decision makers of today. Earlier in society, as defined by a man, a woman's role was to solely cook, clean, run a house, marry young, and it utterly baffles me that because of our gender, women were once excluded from the participation in who would run their country. It disgusts me to think that women could not keep their earnings and instead had to hand it over to their husbands. I am more than thankful for all the powerful women throughout history that have stood up for themselves, for women and for us. Let's start with Emily Pankhurst, a woman who began the suffragette movement and ensured that all women had the right to vote. I thank her. Next, Michelle Obama, whose main priority as First Lady was to ensure girls across the world received an education. I thank her. And finally, Greta Thunberg, who represents the younger generation and tackles world leaders on their climate change policies. I thank her. However, there is still work to be done. Globally, there are major issues regarding inequality of women, places in which a woman is seen inferior to a man. Despite all the uproar about equality, there are issues such as the gender pay gap, Place in Africa, which still, to this day, take part in female genital mutilation. In Afghanistan, they are stripping away girls' rights to an education, and they are being deprived from this most basic right. To me, education is the most crucial tool for all, because when one is educated, one has knowledge, and when one has knowledge, one has a voice, and a woman with a voice is, by definition, a woman with power. So, my point is, and let me make this clear, never let a man or any individual allow you to feel weak. Never be silenced. Always fight for what you believe is right, and most importantly, let your voice be heard. And today, I am so thankful that me, a young woman, is giving a speech on empowerment and that my voice is being heard. And to conclude my speech today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to quote a comment, but a classic saying by the great Gatsby author, behind every great man is a great woman, and that's my case.